Big blue. Big blue, yes. Nice. Okay, I need to... Yellow, Trevor yellow. is down for the count. Yellow, yellow. You warm out putting that thing together. Oh, yeah, that's good. I just hold on a second. That's, this All is right, not... listen, I thought you were going to finish this tomorrow. No, I am. I'm just 20 pieces away from an architectural geniosity thing here. I think... I, no, I need a red corner. I need a red corner. It's an orange corner. I need a red corner. <clears throat> I got your piece right here. What? You have to find it oh. because toy time is over. Oh, no, honey. It is time to play with me right now. Really? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. This is fantastic. Fantastic. <laughs> Whoa! One eyewitness is all I need to nail your slick ass, Mr. Hayward. One eyewitness. Hey, you're home early. That's not a complaint. You okay? I'm fine. I thought you said you'd have this all cleaned up by the time I got home. Yeah, well, you got home early and I thought you would, baby. Hey, I got it. I got you it. You know what? I can't live like this. Baby, what? What is it? Work, Hayward? Is he, I swear to no, God it's, it's that... Not, it's, it's, it's not David. Then what is it? I'm just tired, that's all. I want to go change. Baby, there's something you're not telling me. What is it? Uh, Angela Hubbard. Angela. It's Dr. Belden. I'm calling about your latest test results. Any chance you'd be able to come down to the hospital to discuss them? Could we meet somewhere else outside the hospital? Not tonight, I'm afraid, and this can't wait until tomorrow. Uh, is there a problem? I'd rather go over everything in person. Sure. It's uh, me again. Um, it's around, uh, uh, well, it's uh, really late there. I'm sorry, you're probably sleeping. Uh, I will call tomorrow, earlier, so you can uh, talk to your girls and hear all about their adventures in Pine Valley. Oh, you should uh, see them with the horses. Oh, last night they uh, both wanted to sleep out in the stables. <laughs> Don't worry, I, uh, I didn't let them. They, um, miss you. We really need to talk. Tomorrow. I hope. I wish I'd never let myself fall for David. What, what does that mean, Greenlee? Is it over between you two? I married him for the wrong reasons. I was hurt. I wanted to hurt back. Hurt me back, you mean? I also believed in him. Maybe too much. If I walk away from you, which you've told me multiple times I'm free to do, you'll go to the police with this evidence. Make them think that I'm the one who sabotaged Erica's plane. Greenland? You can trust me, you know that. I do know that. You're not wearing your wedding ring. I, uh, I took my wedding ring off tonight. Greenlee's at the hospital visiting Ryan Lavery. Get on it, now. Bianca. Hello, David. Well, I'm happy to see you've decided to stay in Pine Valley. Greenlee is grateful to have you at Fusion. Listen, I don't know what you're trying to pull now, but I know Greenlee's looking for her own apartment. Mm, not anymore. She was just going through an emotional time. Maybe because Ryan almost died at your feet? <laughs> 
You know, Bianca, I'm a very powerful man, but not even I can bring on an aneurysm. And Greenlee knows that. Maybe the four of us should get together for dinner sometime. Four of us? Oh, I'm sorry. That's right. Reese didn't come here with the girls. Well, I hope that doesn't mean your marriage is the one that's on the rocks. It's good seeing you. You don't need to listen to my troubles right now. Does it look like I'm going anywhere? It's my problem. Greenly. I'm going to have to deal with it. Greenly. I get why it's hard for you to leave Hayward. I, I understand. He saved your life, and, and he helped you get back on your feet. But that doesn't mean that you owe him your entire future, okay? So if walking away is what you want... It's more than that. Well, then explain it to me. You really need to rest. Despite everything that's happened, all, all that I want, all that I want, is for you to be happy. That's it. And now I, I see that you're not. So if there's anything that I can do to change that, please, I, I want you to tell me right now. Sorry to interrupt. No, no, no problem. Everything all right? At the casino? Is everything cool? Yeah, I'm actually here for Mrs. Hayward. I have orders to bring you down to the station right away. Oh, baby, you just got home. Well, it can't be helped. Can't somebody else handle this emergency? Only one chief of staff. It won't be long. Angela, you are the boss. People are supposed to be jumping through hoops for you, not the other way around. Yeah, well, it doesn't always work that way. One hour. Just take one hour to sit down and have See, some dinner. I have to go in now. Fine. Do whatever you gotta do. Baby, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, okay? I just, um, have a really, really bad migraine. Just one more reason not to go back to the hospital. Listen, sweetheart, please, could you do me a favor? Uh, find me some ibuprofen. Done. Thanks. It's me. Can you please pick me up outside the loft and take me to the hospital? Yeah. Uh, yeah, I could do that. What? Okay, so No, what, what? What are you doing? Oh, the hospital needs me. Jake. I'm sorry, baby. That was Angie, wasn't it? It was, yeah. You cannot be the only doctor on call. Well, no, but she's actually helping me out if you want to know the truth. By keeping you on 24-7 alert? Honey, you got to understand that David came on, he's looking to get rid of us in the worst way possible, so we figure the more hours we put in, you know, the more indispensable we become. And more exhausted. Well, yeah, but that's why we're working together, you know? I take care of her, she takes care of me. I want to take care of you. Oh, baby, you do. You do take care of me. I love you so much. Oh, I know we should take care of me. All right, when well, I gotta go, now I'll be back. And I love you. I, I love you. I'll see you soon. Don't be long. Don't. I need those pieces. Well, at least you can tell me why you have to bring me in. I just got a call and was told to come and get you. That's all the information I have. Does my husband know about this? I don't have any details. Well, what, why would David know about this? I I'm just... I'm just trying to figure out what's going on. Hey, bro, why don't you just call down on the station, huh? I mean, you, you, your orders were to arrest Greenway, right? It's no problem. I'll go. Well, well hold on. Huh? Maybe you, you won't have to go. No, whatever it is, it'll probably be easier if I just straighten it out in person. I'll be okay. Will you call me to let me know that? I promise. <laughs> 